I think it's very important that I mention before we continue and certainly so you don't miss this step when you get to the first three steps if it asks you for an age I believe you need to be at least 13 years and older to one use Steam and two use VR Chat. Obviously I would endorse you do the correct age but if you were not going to do the correct age make it so you are 13 and plus so you can play this game. With that being said let's continue with the next steps. I've been making this video probably non-stop since I got home from work. So a few of you are having a few issues with the actual getting onto the VR chat account or getting onto VR chat. I'm just going to make a new video, fresh video, fresh start for everyone. Now most of you are going to have completed several of these steps already. But just bear with me. I'll put a time marker in where you can skip past the bits you've probably already done, which is going to be the creating of an email address, the creating of a Steam account and the creating of a VR chat account. For those of you who have not done this step, keep listening. For those of you who have done this step, click on the marker below skipping these bits to go to the important next steps so let's go ahead and get right into this so the very very first thing I'm gonna get you guys to do is create an email address now I will leave all of these links in the description so you can do this in order of how I've done it so make an email address I use Google it's the easiest one I can link it to my YouTube it has two-step verification so it's very secure once you've done that, I want you to go ahead and create a Steam account. Again, you've probably already done this, some of you. Just stay with us. This link will also be in the bottom. Very, very simple. The email address you've created and then logged into, use that same email address to complete the Steam step. Once you've done the Steam step, log in and you'll be greeted with this. This is just the web page. I haven't I'm not going to go through the downloading of Steam just yet. And then finally, once you've done the first two steps, I want you to go ahead and visit the VR Chat website. Click login in the top right hand corner and then click register. Or go straight to this page, which I will leave in the description. So by this point, you should have completed the first three steps. You should have an email address you should have a Steam account linked to the same email address. You should have a VR Chat account linked to the same email address. Once you have got to this stage, what I want you to do is go into the VR Chat account, log in. You should be greeted with your username and pretty much nothing else. A couple of tabs here. I want you to click the download button. This is going to bring up these two. Now you don't need to worry about these bottom two unless you're putting your own avatars into the game. So we'll skip that because I don't know how to do that but you want to click on this bit here, Steam Client. That's going to take you to the Steam front where you can find the game. So, if you haven't done so already, install Steam. I have completed this step already. So I will load up Steam. And as you can see, I have no games installed, I have no software installed, um, and that's it, nothing else. As you can see, when I clicked on the download link from VRChat, it brought me to the VRChat Steam page. So now what I can do, click play, click yes, Steam is installed. Yours should pop up with some sort of link like the following. Click OK to open the Steam client bootstrapper. This will download the game if you don't want to do it this way. Copy and paste. VR chat from the website into your Steam client via the search bar and you will have VR chat, same as what I'm seeing now. Download the game. I'm going to install this on my SSD because it's a little quicker. And I will come back to you once this is downloaded. Okay, so by this point, you should have now your email address. Steam account, your VR chat account, Steam downloaded, and the game downloaded. Now, my shortcuts on my desktop are not working properly at all, so I'm going to delete that for now and just I'll figure that bit out later. But go on to Steam, go to Library, Games, 
right click it, play game. Okay, so the first time you load up VRChat, you should be greeted with this screen. If you've played it before, it's going to automatically try and log into your Steam account. We don't want that. So, if you are logged into your Steam account already, go into Escape menu, Settings, Log Out. Don't exit the game, log out, and you'll get the same screen as what we would be seeing. Next step, click VR Chat account instead, this button on the left, or if you so wish to, if you haven't completed the steps before this, you can create a VR Chat account here, and that'll take you to the website. But for most of you that are following this tutorial, you've already got everything you need to log in. So log in. So once your username's in, just click the OK button. And once your password's in, click the OK button. If you have two ticks, you're good to go. Now clicked on, what we're going to do, we're going to hit the escape button once. And we'll go to settings. And what we should see is our username in the bottom right hand corner which we do. That's it. You should be fine to go from that point. I don't think you'll have any more issues, but if you do, please leave a message in the, in the comments and I'll try my best to help again. If not, then I really have to suggest you speak to VR chat um, themselves and their support or the FAQs on their forums. It's as much as I can do. But if you followed this tutorial step by step, you should be good to go. I recommend you watch the whole video just in case. But thank you for tuning in. Hopefully this has helped explain it a bit better than last time.